and what the will of the Lord is. So God, we know that there is a will and a divine purpose that you have for each and every one of our lives and that if we are still around, then that means that hope is for the living and that there is something that you have for us to accomplish. So God, help us in the name of Jesus to understand your will. God, there's somebody right now who doesn't have a proper understanding of your will. There's somebody right now, dear God, they don't know which way to turn. They don't know where to put their foot down next. They don't know exactly how to do what it is that they feel they should do. There's somebody right now, dear God, they feel something, but they don't know how to go about it. But God, in the name of Jesus, help us to accomplish your will. Help us to understand what your will is for our lives. Even in those moments of confusion, dear Lord, Lord, help us to give into your will and not to our own will, dear God. God, some of us are faced with some severe battles right now. We have emotional battles, financial battles, battles within our health, dear Lord. We have spiritual battles, all sorts of things going on in our lives. And God, it becomes complicated sometimes to separate our own will from your will because it seems like our own voice is so loud in our heads based on what it is that we are enduring but God help us in the name of Jesus through the power of your word to learn how to silence our own voice that we'll be able to hear your directives while we are moving through this season because God we don't want to miss your mark concerning our lives in this season God we know that everything that is happening in us to us and around us that it must work for us because you said in your word that all things work together for the good so God help us in the name of Jesus to recognize that good must come from our situations and give us the peace and the know-how and the wisdom to know how to navigate these situations so that we can happen upon the good that you want to produce from it. So God, help us in the name of Jesus to be a people that are steadfast. Help us to be steadfast in your word. Help us to be steadfast concerning our prayer. Help us in the name of Jesus to do as you said in your word that we should pray without ceasing dear father help us to have a heart and a mind of prayer help us to be the type of people that are constantly looking unto you because you are indeed the author and the finisher of our faith help us to not lean to our own understanding help us to not lean to our own wisdom even in these situations dear God that we think we got it figured out help us to still lean to you and to look to you dear God because your way is always better than our way and you are the omniscient God and you know all things you know the secret things you know the secret thoughts you know what's up the road you know the plans of man you know the plots of the enemy you know dear father how everything will go so God help us in the name of Jesus to not lean on our own wisdom help us to not lean on our own insight help us to not even lean on our own history because God sometimes our history is not going to tell us what's happening in the next set but God help us in the name of Jesus to recognize that our steps are ordered by you and then help us dear God to lean into the ordering of your steps for our lives God help us to lean into your knowledge concerning our lives help us to lean into your prophetic word concerning our lives help us in the name of Jesus to be a people that are constantly putting our ear to your mouth so that we can hear you when you speak dear God I pray in the name of Jesus that you will sanctify our hearing dear God help us to hear you as we are moving through life help us to recognize your voice even in the, the moments that life seems to be so loud help us to recognize your voice dear God above the sounds of other people's opinions help us to recognize your voice dear God above the voice of our doctors and our teachers help us to recognize your voice dear God God, above the voices of those that we even trust dear God because even the same way Peter was within your cabinet but yet there was a moment dear God that he was operating under a different influence so God help us in the name of Jesus to recognize the influences that are around us that we'll be able to remain focused concerning your purpose and your plans for our lives so God I pray in the name of Jesus that you will make us sensitive to you dear father 
Make us sensitive to your voice. Make us sensitive to the seasons. Make us sensitive to even the assignments that are over our lives, dear God. Because, Father, sometimes our lives become so hard and it gets easy to turn aside from the assignment that you have given us. But, God, in the name of Jesus, help us to be steadfast and unmovable. Help us to always abound, dear God, in your word, knowing that our labor will not be in vain, knowing that our pushing forward toward purpose is not in vain knowing that our constant praying and fasting and believing is not in vain dear God so God help us in the name of Jesus to be a people dear father that are rooted and grounded there's somebody dear God they're being shaken right now they're being challenged on every side and even in the midnight hours their faith grows weak dear father when they begin to ponder on the situations that they're in but God I pray in the name of Jesus Jesus, the same way you prayed for Peter that our faith would fail us not. So God, I lift up your people to you now, dear Father, and I pray that you cause their faith to not fail them. Don't allow their faith to fail them when they're on the brink of failure. Don't allow their faith to fail them when they get that bad report. Don't allow their faith to fail them when it seems like what they're building is now falling to the side. Don't allow their faith to fail them when it seems like the house that they're building and has leaks but God in the name of Jesus help us to recognize that you will never bring us this far to leave us help us to recognize that you are a good good father because you said in your word if it will a father give his son snake for meat and will a father give his son stone for bread you said that if evil fathers evil men know how to give good gifts unto their children then how much more will you do for us so God I pray in the name of of Jesus that you will bring under subjection right now the spirit of anxiety God somebody is anxious right now they are anxious concerning their lives they are anxious concerning the doctor's report they are anxious concerning their college career they are anxious concerning their business they are anxious concerning their relationship they have anxiety concerning their families they have anxiety even just concerning the future when they think about the future when they think about not even the far away future God somebody has anxiety when they think about tomorrow when they think about next week when they think about will the next paycheck be right when they think about how will things turn out in September there's somebody who has anxiety dear father based on what it is that they've experienced on their yesterday but God I pray in the name of Jesus that in the midst of anxiety that you will cause your word to lift up a standard within the inside of us dear God cause your word to raise a standard within our minds dear God you told us to be anxious for nothing oh God help us to be anxious for nothing God help us in the name of Jesus to recognize that you are with us and that you are standing by us you said lo I'll be with you always even until the end of the world you told us that as we pass through the fire you'll be with us you told us that as we go through the flood that you will be with us God somebody's going through a flood right now of financial distress somebody's trying to figure out how they're going to pay the rent how they're going to pay the mortgage how they're going to pay the car note how they're going to pay the insurance how they're going to take care of the accident how they're going to take care of the tuition how they're going to take care of their son and their daughter how they're going to take care of their family how they're going to move from where they are but God, I pray in the name of Jesus that you will send resources unto your people and give us the faith, dear Father, and the peace within our minds to hold on until the resource come. Help us to hold on until the next instruction come. Help us to hold on until the new job comes. Help us to hold on until you take us to the next level. For God, you will never leave us and you will never forsake us. That's why we are here on tonight, dear Father. We are casting our cares on you because you told us to do that because you care for us so we cast 
cast our burdens upon you dear father we cast the burden of our sickness upon you we cast the burden of our children upon you we cast the burden concerning our cars upon you we cast the burden concerning our family relationships upon you we cast the burden concerning the fractured relationships upon you we cast the burden of our ministries upon you we cast the burden dear God concerning our job upon you we cast the burden dear God concerning our friends upon you for God it's too heavy for us we can't carry the weight of these things father but God you are stronger than we are so God we are looking unto you for you are the author and the finisher of our faith you are the one who has started this work and you said in your word he which hath begun a good work in us will perform it until the day of Jesus Christ so God perform the work in the name of Jesus bind up the hand of the enemy dear father that tries to come against the performance of your work in our lives God the enemy is trying to fight us the enemy is trying to break someone he's trying to break someone's confidence he's trying to break someone's faith he's trying to break someone's understanding but God in the name of Jesus I pray that you allow your Holy Spirit to cause the loins of our minds to be girded up by the power of your word dear father that we can hold fast until we see your promises happen for you said in your word dear God that your promises are yea and amen so God we are looking unto to you right now and we are calling forth your benefits dear God let the benefits of your word come to existence in our lives let the benefit of your word dear God heal us let the benefits that come through your word make us whole in the mighty name of Jesus dear God for God you said that your word will not return unto you void but it will accomplish exactly what you set out for it to do so God in the mighty name of Jesus let your word come forth with power in our lives dear God the same way you spoke in the beginning and everything that you declared came forth God send your word in our circumstance right now in the mighty name of Jesus the same way the centurion said that all you gotta do is speak a word dear father God we ask for you to speak a word right now because you said that the entrance of your word brings light so God bring light right now to every dark situation Lord bring light right now to every dark region of our minds Lord bring light right now to every dark region of our homes Lord bring light right now to every dark region in our family Lord bring light right now and shift your divine weight dear God and cause our lives in the name of Jesus to mount up to the power that you have called for it to be dear God so I pray right now dear God that you abolish the work of the enemy that's trying to move against us right now and perform a miracle on the behalf of your people dear God bring down and tear down every stronghold dear God and cause us to flourish dear God like the olive branch Lord in the mighty name of Jesus let your oil rest upon us and cause us to move forward dear God in the power of your might Lord cause us to move forward dear God in the power of your strength cause us to move forward God in the power of your glory cause us to move forward God in the power Help us to move forward, dear God, uh, in the name of the Lord Jesus. Uh, don't allow us to remain stagnant, Father, but help us to push on and press on in the name of Jesus. Uh, we bind the spirit of stagnation right now, God, uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, and we pray that you help us to press and to push in the name of Jesus. Uh, we don't want to be in the same place today uh, that we're going to be this time next year. But, Father, we pray against stagnation, oh God. Uh, Father, you said that you gave us the key to the kingdom uh, that whatsoever we bind on earth uh, shall be bound in heaven and whatsoever we loose on earth uh, shall be loosed in heaven so father we bind stagnation uh, in the name of Jesus uh, but we press on oh God uh, help us to press on and see what the end will be uh, 
Help us to endure hardship as a good soldier. Help us to hold on and see what your will is, oh God. In the name of Jesus, help us to move forward in your power. Help us to move forward in your authority. Help us to move forward in your favor. Help us to move forward in your blessings. Help us to move forward in your anointing. Help us to move forward in the name of Jesus. Why? Because you have not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. So we bind the spirit of fear that would try to hold us back, oh God. In the name of Jesus, help us to not be fearful, but to operate in the power of the Holy Ghost that we can move forward. Help us to not operate in fear, but help us to ascend to where you want us to go. In the name of Jesus, take us to a higher height tonight. Take us to a deeper depth tonight, oh God. In the name of Jesus, we don't want to be plateaued. We don't want to be in the same level. We don't want to be stuck here. We don't want to be in the same place. But God, take us higher. But God, take us further. But God, push us forward. In the name of Jesus, oh God, you said that they that wait upon the Lord, you shall renew their strength. They shall mount up on wings as eagles, and they shall run and not be weary, and they shall walk and not faint. Father, somebody's weary in their mind. Somebody's weary in their body. Somebody's weary in their spirit, and they don't want to move forward. But we pray that you help us to hold on until you renew our strength. Renew us tonight. Revive us tonight. Send revival in the name of Jesus that we can press on. Send renewal tonight that we can move forward. Send rejuvenation tonight that we can press on in the name of Jesus. Send a refreshing tonight. Send a refreshing tonight. Send a refreshing tonight. Refresh us in the Holy Ghost. Oh, glory to God. Refresh us in the Holy Ghost tonight that we can move forward in the name of Jesus. Help us to be refreshed. Refill us tonight. Fill our cups again that we can move forward in the name of Jesus. Fill us up, oh God, till we want no more. We present ourselves to you as empty pitchers tonight that you can fill us up and fuel us for the journey ahead. We need a refueling for what's ahead of us, oh God. There is an assignment. There is a will of God that is ever before us. There is an agenda of God that lies before us and we need to be filled so that we can accomplish so that we can do your will so that we can press on and accomplish your purpose in the name of Jesus we bind depression that's trying to keep us bound we bind depression that's trying to keep our mind we bind depression in the name of Jesus and we pray that you loose the bands of wickedness that would try to keep our minds from progressing forward our thoughts oh God are the same oh God and they seem to be a revolving door but we pray against the spirit of depression that would try to keep our thoughts bound we pray against the spirit of depression that would try to keep our hearts bound we pray against the spirit of depression that would try to keep our minds bound in the name of Jesus but we lose the bands of wickedness. We loose, oh God, your peace in our minds. We loose, oh God, your understanding. We loose, oh God, a new thought pattern. We're stuck in our minds, but Father, you can deliver. We're stuck in our hearts, but Father, you can set free. We're stuck in our spirits, but Father, you can make us whole. Make us whole tonight in the name of Jesus. Make us whole tonight in the name of of Jesus uh, every void oh God uh, fill it tonight father in the name of Jesus uh, father oh God uh, fill us tonight oh God uh, every dark hole oh God uh, every dark place oh God uh, father your word declares uh, at the edges of your word uh, it 
does bring light. Uh, so shed light, oh God, uh, on every dark region of our lives tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, where there is confusion, uh, shed the light of your word. Uh, where there is dissension, uh, shed the light of your word. Uh, where there is depression, uh, shed the light of your word. Uh, where there is low self-esteem, uh, shed the light of your word. Uh, where there is a mess in turmoil, uh, shed the light of your word. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, let your word be unto us, uh, a lamp unto our feet, uh, and a light unto our pathway. Uh, let your word, oh God, uh, illuminate the path before us, uh, that we can clearly see uh, what you have for us to do. Uh, so we pray, oh God, uh, that you open our eyes. Uh, we pray for fresh vision uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, oh God, uh, we bind the scales uh, that are trying to cover our eyes. Uh, and we pray for fresh vision uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, we open our eyes in the spirit. Uh, open our eyes in the spirit. Uh, open our eyes in the spirit uh, that we can see clearly uh, what is up ahead the road of us. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, Thank you, Lord God. Uh, illuminate the pathway before us tonight, Father. In the name of Jesus, uh, shed your light, O oh God. Uh, Father, your word declares unto us uh, that the steps of a good man, uh, they are ordered by the Lord, uh, and he delighteth in his way. Uh, so order our steps in your word tonight. Uh, allow us to see clearly. Uh, allow us to hear clearly. Uh, we come against, O oh God, uh, deaf ears, O oh God. Uh, we come against dim eyes. Uh, but Father, Father, make us alert and on time in the spirit uh, that we can know what you want us to do, uh, that we can know what you want us to say, uh, that we can know where you want us to go. Uh, make us on time and alert in the spirit. Uh, I pray for more discernment uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, in the lives of God's people. Uh, I pray for heightened discernment uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I pray that you would increase us uh, to know the sign of the times uh, like the sons of Issachar. I pray that you revive our spirit man uh, that we can be more in tune with you uh, wake us up in the spirit uh, don't allow us to sleep on the job uh, but whatever you called us to do oh God uh, whatever gift you place on the inside of us uh, stir it up tonight father I pray for stirred gifts tonight uh, in the name of Jesus uh, that you would revive the spirit man uh, who is weak oh God uh, in the name of Jesus uh, revive our spirits tonight uh, Revive our spirits tonight. Uh, somebody's weary, oh God, uh, in their well doing. Uh, but Father, you said that if we do not give up, oh God, uh, we shall reap, oh God, uh, because we have not fainted. Uh, so help us, oh God, uh, even in our weariness, oh God, uh, to grab hold, oh God, uh, to the horn of the altar uh, and to pray and seek your face. Uh, we are praying tonight, oh God. Uh, we grab hold to you, oh God. Uh, we grab hold to the horn of the altar. Uh, we grab hold of your presence uh, and we ask oh God uh, that you stir us up tonight uh, stir us up oh God uh, every gift and vision uh, stir it up tonight oh God uh, every dream and idea uh, stir it up tonight oh God uh, every calling and election uh, stir it up tonight oh God uh, don't allow us to sleep on the job uh, but I pray oh God uh, that you increase our spiritual senses uh, in the name of Jesus uh, open our hearing God uh, enlighten our seeing God uh, help us to feel you when you're moving uh, help us to see you when you're moving God uh, in the name of Jesus uh, help us to wake up in the Holy Ghost uh, wake us up in the Holy Ghost Father uh, wake us up in the Holy Ghost Jesus uh, and move over us God uh, if it had to be at 3 in the morning uh, wake us up in the Holy Ghost uh, whatever you've got to do oh God uh, but stir us tonight oh God uh, we pray for a stirring God uh, that you you will trouble our spirits uh, to know when to pray, oh God, uh, to know when to speak, oh God, uh, to know when to make the move, oh God, uh, to know when to step out on faith. Uh, quicken our spirits tonight. Uh, quicken us tonight, Father. Uh, quicken us tonight, Holy Ghost. Uh, quicken us in the spirit realm uh, that we can know what your instructions are. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, quicken us tonight, Father, uh, to know when to make the next move. Uh, quicken us tonight, oh God, uh, to know when to be able to minister to somebody else uh, quicken us tonight father uh, in the name of Jesus uh, 
quicken us oh God and catch us up in the spirit father oh God catch us up tonight father somebody's feeling left behind somebody feels left back somebody's feeling they're too late but you can catch us up in the spirit so I pray for acceleration oh God in the name of Jesus it's never too late to do what God called you to do it's never too late to do what God has instructed so I pray oh God that the spirit of acceleration be upon your people tonight catch us up tonight oh God catch us up in the spirit father catch us up tonight oh God catch us up oh God catch us up oh God where we are lacking father catch us up father where we feel left behind catch us up tonight in the name of Jesus as a regard to our purpose catch us up tonight we are not far behind we are not left back we are not held back but we are accelerated by the power of the Holy Ghost so catch us up oh God in the name of Jesus push us forward God accelerate us oh God catapult us oh God to our next level in the name of Jesus oh God it doesn't matter what we've lost or what time we've lost because your word declares that I will restore to you the years of the canker worm and the palmer worm and the locust and the caterpillar has eaten up from you so father we pray tonight for restoration of time restoration of time restoration of time tonight in the name of Jesus restore the time that may have been taken oh God if we did it to ourselves we say that we're sorry and we repent but we thank you that you shall restore you shall restore you shall give it back to us you shall give us back the time you shall redeem the time on our behalf thank you for redemption of time thank you for redeeming the time concerning your people we are not behind but we are at the appointed place at the appointed time we are not left behind but we are in the right place at the right time to receive a word from you to receive your blessing uh, to receive your instruction uh, so download uh, in our spirits uh, download uh, in our spirits uh, download uh, in our spirits uh, what you want next from us uh, download uh, by the way of the Holy Ghost uh, what our next assignment is uh, because we are not too late uh, to fulfill the purpose of God uh, download uh, what you have next for us uh, in the name of Jesus uh, we need instruction uh, we need direction uh, we need correction uh, we need your help tonight uh, so help us tonight uh, push us God uh, push us in the spirit uh, push us in the spirit uh, push us in the spirit uh, push us forward uh, I speak forward movement uh, I hear the sound of an army uh, moving forward in the Holy Ghost uh, oh my God uh, I hear the Lord say uh, you've got the whole host of heaven uh, backing you up tonight uh, so that you can move forward uh, you've got the host of heaven uh, the God of heaven's armies uh, you've got the army of God uh, backing you up uh, that you can move forward uh, I hear footsteps uh, I hear footsteps uh, I hear progression uh, in the spirit uh, he's pushing us forward uh, he's taking us higher uh, he said hey glory to God I hear hey show my I hear an army behind us. I hear an army behind us. He is sending help to push us forward. He is sending help to push us forward. He Thank you, Lord Jesus. He's sending help. Help is here tonight. He said, I sent help from the sanctuary of God. All that you need is here tonight. All that you need, he's sending his help. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. You're not left behind. I know there are others who have gone before you, but he sends his help to back you up. Hey, glory to God.
Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I hear footsteps. Thank Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah to God. Thank you for sending your help. He sends us help tonight. Help, help, help. It's in the sanctuary. Help of a living God. It's on its way to you, to those that are at home. He is sending help tonight. In our weakness, his strength is made perfect. He is perfecting his strength on the inside of his people. Help is here tonight. Hey, glory to God. Hey, glory to God. Help is here tonight. Glory to God. Lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors. And the King of glory has already come in, and he's come with help. He has come with help tonight. Hey, glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. He comes with help tonight. Thank you for renewing our strength. Thank you for touching our bodies. I pray strength, supernatural strength. Uh, be in your bodies tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I bind weariness. Uh, I bind stress. Uh, I bind every byproduct of stress uh, that tries to eat up your body. Uh, I bind it in the name of Jesus. Uh, hallelujah to God. Uh, the stress that tries to come in uh, like a virus. Uh, I hear a virus. Uh, but the Spirit of God says uh, it is bound tonight it is bound tonight you shall be free to move in your body and do what God has called you to do I bind every sickness I bind every virus I bind the vulnerability of your body uh, as a result of the stress that you are enduring uh, and I pray that you are built up uh, in your body uh, strength be applied uh, strength be applied uh, the strength of the Holy Ghost uh, be applied tonight uh, in the name of Jesus uh, to your bodies uh, he was wounded uh, for our transgressions uh, he was bruised uh, for our iniquities uh, and the chastisement uh, of our peace upon you huh? and with his stripes huh? we are healed 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 huh? every byproduct huh? is destroyed huh? in the name of Jesus it is destroyed huh? it is cast down huh? we cast it down huh? in the name of Jesus huh? but we shall huh? live oh God huh? declare the works of the Lord we shall not die but we shall live to declare his works in the name of Jesus God we pray your word back to you help us to live tonight help us to live tonight help us to live tonight in the name of Jesus thank you Lord thank you Lord thank you glory hey glory to God Thank you, Jesus. Help us to live tonight in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, God. Regulate our bodies tonight. Uh, every impurity, Father. Uh, everything that's out of order. Uh, we call upon you, Father, uh, to call it to order, oh God. Uh, allow it to be ordered by the power of the living God. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, every impurity, Father. Uh, everything that's not like you uh, that tries to invade the body. Uh, every unwarranted bacteria, Father. Uh, we come against it tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, oh God. God, we pray, oh God, uh, that you build our immune systems. Uh, we come against every immunodeficiency, oh God, uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, and we pray uh, for the strength of our immune systems tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, that there would be nothing uh, that tried to come up against these bodies. Uh, but they are shielded and protected uh, and covered tonight uh, by the blood of Jesus Christ. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, build our immunity, Father. In the name of Jesus, 
We bind, oh God, uh, every cancerous cell uh, that tries to build, uh, that tries to grow, uh, that tries to regenerate. Uh, we even come against repeat offenders uh, in the bodies of your people, Father. Uh, and we pray, oh God, uh, that you destroy it uh, at the root, uh, that you take it out, uh, that you perform surgery. Uh, we know we have doctors, uh, but you are the chief surgeon. Uh, you are the chief physician. Uh, you are our healing. Uh, you are our balm and Gilead. Uh, so we pray, oh God, uh, that you touch these bodies. Uh, oh God, that you have created, uh, that you have made, uh, that you have put together. Uh, touch these bodies tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, oh God, uh, heal us and we shall be healed. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, you are the great physician. Uh, so touch us tonight uh, with your finger of love. Uh, every impurity, God, uh, every unregulated thing, uh, regulated tonight, Father. Uh, every system uh, of the body, uh, be regulated tonight uh, by the power of God. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, touch us tonight. Uh, lay your hand upon us tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, lay your hand upon us tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, lay your hand upon us tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, would you give God praise for healing tonight? Come on, praise him for your healing. No, come on, praise him for your healing. Hallelujah. He's regenerating everything that's not right in the body. Regeneration of blood cells. Uh, regeneration of bones. Uh, regeneration of uh, ligaments. Uh, regeneration tonight. He is fixing. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, touch the back, oh God. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, regeneration of the spine. Uh, every misalignment. Uh, we call it to order. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, we call it to order. Uh, we call it to order. Uh, we call it to order. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, if it's our of place put it back in place and we speak the fire of God will consume everything that's not like you in the body tonight Lord send your healing Lord send your healing Lord send your healing in the name of Jesus the fire of God permeate everything and remove oh God what's not like you in the name of Jesus Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. If it's out of order, we call it to order in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to your name tonight, Father. We call it to order by the power of God in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We pray for our family members who are sick and afflicted, God. We pray for those that are on their sick bed tonight. You know where they are. Father, search them out in the spirit and touch their bodies tonight. In the name of Jesus, wherever they may be at, Father, if they're at home, oh God, if they're in the hospital, Father, even if they're in the hospice, Father, you can't do any and everything but fail. And so we thank you tonight uh, that you shall heal them uh, and give them a testimony of your goodness. Uh, so heal them, Father. We've come together as your people, uh, oh God, and we pray that you heal them uh, off of our faith. Uh, Father, the same faith uh, that they exemplified. Uh, when they lowered the man who was afflicted uh, down to the ceiling uh, and you healed him uh, because of their faith uh, we come to you tonight uh, asking that you heal our family members uh, because of our faith uh, we believe you tonight uh, we stand on your word uh, we trust you uh, Father heal them uh, for our sake uh, Father touch them uh, for our sake uh, Father save them uh, for our sake uh, Father deliver them God uh, for our sake uh, Father, heal them uh, for our sake. Uh, we come to you tonight uh, in full faith, uh, thanking you even in advance uh, for healing their bodies, uh, for touching them, God. Uh, Father, heal that loved one. Uh, Father, save that child. Uh, Father, touch that brother. Uh, Father, touch that father. Uh, touch that mother, oh God. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, that sister, oh God, uh, who needs you right now. Uh, Father, search them out uh, and touch them father in the name of Jesus hey. 
Search them out, Father. So, hey, put the searchlight on in the spirit. Uh, we may not know where they're at, Father. They could be on the street. Uh, they could be in the crack house. Uh, they may be in the jail. Uh, but Father, put the searchlight on uh, in the spirit uh, and go and see about your children. Uh, we call them out to you tonight. Uh, we lift them up before you tonight. Uh, put the searchlight on uh, and search them out uh, and save tonight uh, and heal tonight uh, and deliver tonight uh, and set free tonight uh, make them whole tonight uh, in the name of Jesus we come against bipolarism in the name of Jesus every chemical imbalance in their mind father search them out uh, and deliver tonight hallelujah we thank you for deliverance of our loved ones we thank you Oh my God, uh, somebody prayed for deliverance tonight. Uh, thank you for delivering them tonight. Uh, you shall deliver. Uh, you shall set free. Uh, oh God, uh, we call their names uh, before you the altar tonight. Uh, we put them, oh God, uh, on the altar of sacrifice. Uh, and we ask, oh God, uh, that you deliver. Uh, that you set free. Uh, that you change their minds. Uh, change their minds. Uh, change their minds. Uh, Take the murder out of their hearts uh, and deliver them tonight uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, take it out of them tonight. Uh, set them free. Uh, set them free. Uh, break the bands uh, of wickedness uh, that have our loved ones bound. Uh, break it tonight. 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 Uh, in the name of Jesus. Break the bands of wickedness tonight, Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus, and set them free, Father, in the name of Jesus. Set them free, O oh God. Set them free in their minds, Father, in the name of Jesus. Set them free in their minds, God. Set them free in their minds, God. Oh, God, we come against, oh, God, uh, the enemy that tries to use them as, an, as his own agent. Uh, but we declare that they belong to you tonight, Father. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, every blueprint of Satan that tries to use our loved ones, Father, as an agent of destruction, we destroy the blueprints tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, and we pray that you recover their minds fully and completely and totally and bring them unto yourself. Uh, Give them an experience, uh, the same way you gave Saul uh, on the road to Damascus. Uh, give them a life-changing experience. Uh, we thank you uh, that you shall change their lives. Uh, you shall change their minds. Uh, you shall change their habits. Uh, you shall change their addictions. Uh, you shall change their thought patterns. Uh, you shall change their bodies. Uh, you shall even change their countenance. Uh, because you are delivering, uh, change them tonight. Uh, put the searchlight on uh, and find them where they are uh, and change them uh, and set them free in the name of Jesus that wayward brother that messed up father that grandchild you know all about it father that cousin that estranged family member you know all about it father Father, go and search them out and find them, Father. You know where they are. You know the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. You know all about them, Father. We may not be able to even contact them, uh, but we go and grab them in the spirit by way of prayer. And we ask you, God, uh, to send your angels out on assignment uh, on their behalf tonight. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to your name, Father. Thank you for deliverance, oh God. Thank you that you are saving that loved one. That you are changing that loved one, Father. That you are setting them free, oh God, in the name of Jesus. We thank you for freedom tonight. In the name of Jesus, thank you for freedom tonight. In the name of Jesus, thank you for being free tonight. That they are free. That we are free. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Father. 
Thank you for freedom tonight, oh God. Uh, in the mighty and precious name of Jesus. Uh, and Father, as we pray that you search them out, Father. Father, go up and through this house and search us out, Father. You know all about us, Father. Every unspoken prayer request, uh, every desire of our heart, Father. You said in your word that you would never leave us nor forsake us. Uh, and so we pray, oh God, uh, that you read the tablets of our hearts, uh, knowing that you have not forgotten us. Uh, but Father, remember us in prayer. When you seek the Father on our behalf, Lord Jesus, uh, remember us tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, your word declares to us, uh, for I know the thoughts that I think toward you, uh, saith the Lord, thoughts of peace, uh, and not of evil to give you an expected end. Uh, we thank you, O oh God, uh, that you shall reveal your expected end. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, concerning us as your children, uh, touch us tonight, Father. Touch this house, O oh God. Uh, lay a hand upon these thy people, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, that whenever we have cried, oh God, uh, that we may not have been able to utter with words, Father, that you move over it uh, the same way you move over the face of the water, Father, that you would accept our tears as prayer, that you would hear our humble cry, uh, that you move over our requests uh, according to your will, oh God. Uh, whatever we need tonight, uh, we know it's in you. Uh, we know everything we need uh, is in you. Uh, and so we call upon you tonight uh, to touch us, oh God. Uh, Touch this house. Touch this ministry. Uh, touch our leader tonight. Uh, anoint him again. Uh, from the crown of his head uh, to the sole of his feet. Uh, we pray supernatural strength. Uh, be endowed upon our pastor. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, envelop him in your anointing. Uh, and cover him in your blood. Uh, we thank you, O oh God, uh, that the attack of the enemy uh, over his life is destroyed. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, but that you encamp your angels uh, round about him. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, and that you would endow him with power uh, endow with more anointing uh, and of your spirit and grace uh, thank you for using him uh, once more and again uh, Father give him fresh vision uh, fresh understanding of your word uh, put fresh rhema in his belly uh, in the name of Jesus uh, that you would continue to anoint him uh, in the name of Jesus uh, and prosper the works of his hands uh, we thank you now uh, that you shall catapult him uh, come on church help me pray for the pastor uh, catapult him to a new level uh, in the name of Jesus uh, touch him right now sanctify him even more father move in his request uh, whatever his secret prayers are uh, we stand in agreement by faith uh, that you will answer them uh, whatever he's seeking you for uh, that you will move over it father we stand in agreement uh, anyway, that the whole host of heaven uh, would back him up uh, in the name of Jesus uh, touch your man servant uh, cover him underneath your blood uh, and use him for your glory uh, strength be his portion 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 uh, in the name of Jesus uh, come on church help me travail uh, strength be his portion uh, in the name of Jesus uh, cover that car uh, cover that house uh, cover his job uh, in the name of Jesus uh, in the name of Jesus uh, we come against vandalism uh, in the name of Jesus uh, but he is fully protected uh, and covered uh, in the blood of Jesus Christ uh, and and we thank you for it uh, and we praise you for it uh, and we glorify you for it uh, in the name of Jesus uh, he is under your protection uh, and so we thank you uh, that you shall preserve him uh, the rest of his days uh, that there shall be no harm uh, that shall come nigh his dwelling uh, in the name of Jesus It shall not come nigh his dwelling. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Cover this house. Cover this property in the name of Jesus. I come against every burglar in the name of Jesus. I bind the spirit of vandalism right now. I bind the spirit of arson right now, God. Up and down this block even, I pray, oh God, that you would bind the spirit of arson and that you would take it out of that person's heart right now, Father. In the name of Jesus, I pray against every destructive attempt of the enemy against God's kingdom tonight. Uh, and I pray that the blood of Jesus Christ uh, would cover this house, uh, would cover your people, uh, would cover this environment, uh, would cover this community. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, this community is covered uh, 
under the blood of Jesus Christ, uh, we pray against, uh, oh God, fires trying to run up and through the buildings uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, but we are shielded and protected uh, under Jesus Christ's blood. Uh, and we thank you now for protection. Uh, thank you now for protection. Uh, the enemy's blueprints are destroyed uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, it is cast down. Uh, it is broken uh, in the name of Jesus. Jesus thank you for divine protection thank you for divine protection thank you for divine protection that even when we can't see the attempt of the enemy you know all things Lord Jesus uh, and you are protecting us 24 hours of the day uh, 7 days a week uh, when we don't know the attempt is happening uh, you know all about it uh, and you can stop it uh, we thank you for stopping it uh, thank you for stopping it uh, thank you for stopping it uh, in the name of Jesus Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. And we thank you for all these things. We stand in your word and on your promise, knowing that you're not a man, that you should lie. Nor do you have to repent. But if you said it, you will do it. And we believe and stand in your word. And so we stand to our feet and we give you praise and strength. Uh, come on, let's give God praise. If we believe what has been prayed tonight, uh, come on, let's praise him together in strength. Uh, God, we praise you tonight. Uh, we thank you tonight. Uh, we bless your name tonight. Uh, come on, Zion, let's praise him. Uh, thank you for hearing our prayers. Uh, thank you for answering us. Uh, thank you for moving on our behalf. Uh, we thank you, Lord Jesus. Uh, we glorify you uh, we magnify you uh, we lift you up Jesus uh, glory to your name 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 uh, glo hey glory to God uh, glory to your name uh, glory and honor is due unto you uh, come on Zion 60, 30 seconds excuse me let's praise him hallelujah 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 Hallelujah. 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 Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you. Hey, glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Hey, glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. We thank you for all these things. We thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Take us back to our respective homes and destinations. And when we get there, we'll find it better than what we left it, Lord God. Thank you for traveling mercies to and fro. You are our keeper. So keep us. Keep us and we shall be kept. We thank you that you shall bless us till we meet back at the appointed time. We give you praise, honor, and glory because it's always due unto your name. And we pray this prayer in the name of Jesus for his sake. Amen, amen, and amen. All is well with me. You are dismissed in Jesus' name.